In this video we're going to upgrade WordPress to the latest version using a manual method. I've logged into a WordPress site that needs to be upgraded as you can see from the message displayed here. Let's log in to our cPanel now. So now that we've logged into cPanel for the domain that we need to upgrade, click on File Manager. Once the File Manager window loads, Click on Upload. Now locate the WordPress file that we've already prepared. And here it is. So select the zip file, click Open. OK, once the file has uploaded, you can close this window. So let's close the window. And we're back in the cPanel File Manager window. Click Reload. Now here is the zipped WordPress file that we've just uploaded. So select that and click Extract. Click Extract Files. Once all the files have been extracted, click Close. And click Reload again. Okay, so here is the extracted file containing all of the upgrade files. So double click inside here. And now what we want to do is select all of the files. And click move file. Now we're going to move all of these files in the WordPress folder that we've just uploaded and extracted and we're going to move those files to the root directory where the blog, where this particular WordPress blog resides. So just to do that just clear out the entry until you're in the public underscore HTML directory and click move files. Now as you can see all of the files have been moved out of the WordPress directory that we uploaded and extracted. So if we go up one level, basically we've moved all of the files that we're sitting inside this folder up to this level, the root directory level. So there is nothing inside this folder now. So if I double click, see there is nothing. So we go back up here and now we can delete this folder. and we can delete this folder which is the one we uploaded containing all of the latest upgrade files so delete that okay essentially we've upgraded WordPress to the latest version so all we need to do now is go back into our WordPress site and if I just click dashboard and the message database update required comes up and this is what you would expect to see because it's telling you that WordPress has been updated so click on update WordPress database and now it says update complete so when we click continue you can see that we have now upgraded the site to the latest WordPress version